in New York? No idea. No, nothing about it. Obviously, it's a, a baseball <laughs> ground. Um, I've heard it's very tight, so it should be an interesting game. Where do you think you guys are at as a back line in terms of just building chemistry and developing that understanding? Yeah, I think we're getting better every week. Um, you know, we watch a lot of videos after the game. Uh, purely, we do defensive work, you know, watching where we are um, as a back four, and it's definitely getting better. Um, I think you can see that we're keeping a lot more clean sheets. Um, so, yeah, we're getting better, there's, but there's still a, a lot of work to do. And Brad's making the transition back from the midfield. Um, what have you seen him improve upon over these last couple of You guys ask me this every week. <laughs> <laughs> Brad's a good player, you know. Um, like I said before, he's very experienced. Uh, he was a great midfielder. You know, it's going to take him time as a, as a centre-back. But I think off the games, um, he's shown already this season that it's going to be no problem for him to, you know, to go and play there and, and play there for a long time. With three road matches kind of ahead of you guys, what kind of, I guess, challenges does that possess this team as opposed to mixing in road and home matches? Yeah, obviously we prefer to play at home um, with our support. Uh, we feel really confident. Um, but, you know, last season, I think, uh, the guys picked up a lot of um, points away from home, and that's got to be the same this season. You know, there's obviously a few tricky uh, places to go to, and like you say, uh, with three on the bounce, uh, it's important that we we pick up as many points as we can. How difficult is travel on a player's body? I mean, knowing that you have to travel, I don't know, what is it, like an eight-hour flight or something like that to New York and then do it again the following week to Columbus? Yeah, I mean, I'm not used to it, to be honest with you, so this is a new experience for me. Um, but I know when I was in England and Europe that recovery was a massive part of the game, um, so I'm I'm interested to see how we kind of uh, deal with it, um, because like you say, to, to go to New York, I think we're going to come back and then go to Columbus. You know, it takes a lot out of you without playing the game already. How do you prepare for that? Because in England, your trips are so short. So to do something that long, um, how can you prepare for that? Like, I mean, I'm not too sure. Uh, try and get as much info off the, the fitness guys and the players here, you know, how they deal with it. Obviously, you've got the, the boxing match as well, which we, I think we're going to miss. Um, so that's unfortunate. But no, like I said, it's a new experience. So, you know, I'll be watching the other guys to see how they prepare. Have you ever had to go up against David Villa before? And no. no, no, I've never played against him. Um, I mean, I'm not too sure whether he's going to be fit for the game. Um, but yeah, he's a, he's a quality player. Um, obviously very intelligent um, and he's dangerous. But um, I think we've got enough um, to cope. You know, at the back, I think, like you say, the back four is, is gradually getting better and um, we'll be looking to go there and, and, and stop them scoring.